Okay, lean down. No, I'm ready. All right. Hey, you guys. Welcome back to our channel. Okay, get in the frame, please. Can you hold me? <laughs> oh, ow! I literally felt my back giving out. That's why I didn't even like to ride. My little weta. Sis, can we film a YouTube video together? Mm -hmm. All right guys, welcome back to our channel. So about a week or two ago, I went on Amazon and I ordered some very inexpensive prom dresses. I think the most expensive one is like $93 and the cheapest one is probably about like 30 something. We will have the prices on the screen. I'll have them all linked down below. Uh, but basically, I'm going to be trying them on and we're going to be seeing if they're worth the price being like inexpensive like that. And Steven is going to be giving his two cents on them as well. I would like to note, I did not go to prom either times, both times that I had the chance. So I don't know what a prom dress should look like. Yes, you do. Come on. Prom dresses are typically long and like more formal and crazy colors. I did go with all long dresses. I know you don't have to wear a long dress, but when I think of prom dresses, that's what I think of. I'll put a picture up of me and my prom dress. It was actually a high to low dress. I'm kind of saying that it's typically long dresses, but mine wasn't even your typical long dress. Anyway, the dresses that I got are all long. I know you can do short dresses, but I think of homecoming when it comes to short dresses. Let's just get into the video. Wait, you guys wore sh dresses at homecoming? I didn't even have homecoming. We like had, that. We had homecoming with just like the... Yeah, no, there's... We didn't have to dress up. We don't either. We, I've never done that, no. but most schools have homecoming dances. They don't do the garters and stuff. I think isn't that's that like a, a Texas, Texas thing? That's a Texas and Oklahoma thing, doing the mums and garters. But normally people have homecoming dances, but we didn't. We, I didn't do that. I have four dresses to try on for you, and I'm going to do this one first. Would you like me to help zip up? Yes, I would. Some things that I would like to know is that the sequins are already coming off, and the zipper sucks so bad. It does. <clears throat> Can you hold like this tight back here? Yeah. That is really hard. <laughs> it's not very good. I'm still not even done yet. How much do you think this dress costs? You can feel it. Give me a scale, like a, a range, I mean. 30 to 100. <laughs> that is $30. Nope. $93. <laughs> no. One, um, $50. 56 dollars So this dress is 56.99. It's 56 almost 5700. Oh my gosh. $56.99. It feels I feel like it would feel gross it, and like scratchy. It feels nice. Like I'm not like itchy. Yeah, it just I don't think it looks very nice but i could be wrong it could look better on camera i don't have like a mirror that i could look into so it is kind of like bunching up like that i don't know if you could tell so you might have to like fix it at like throughout the night it's also a little bit long but i am 5'2 i think i got size small and i think it fits pretty well and that's what size i t or it's a size two i normally am a size two so i would say this fits like a normal sizing it's not like it's too big or too small um i don't like how it's doing that at the bottom Can yeah you see that so the bottom keeps doing that right there i don't know what you would call that but it's freaking bothering me but it's pretty sparkly what do you think wait so how many I'll do you show, have let me show the back four you have four of them four dresses to wear okay so what i'm gonna do is i'm gonna oh, do it <laughs> oh my gosh it needs to be cut. It's yeah. way too long. I'm gonna do a ranking system. Right now, since I know that there are four and I don't know what the others look like, this one will sit at a one for now. So this is the best one that I've seen. So this will be it and the number one spot. Honestly, I don't think it's a bad dress for $57 at all. I would give this out of five stars. I would give it a four and a half. Yeah, I need to good. dock some points actually for the zipper. It is not expensive feeling at all. Not at all. It is very hard to even unzip even whenever I wasn't in the dress. So I'm actually going to give it a 4.3. Out of five. five. Yes. Okay. What are you going to rate it? I will take your judgment and I will say a 4.5 also. I said 4.3. 4.3. <laughs> 
out of five. How much do you spend on those? Like 800 bucks? Seven? Sometimes, like 300 to 1,000. That's what? crazy. It does not look like the higher end one, but from afar, it doesn't look that bad. Yeah, and if you're on a budget, I think this is, Yeah. I would wear something like this for sure. Mm -hmm. And it's not scratchy like Steven was thinking it might be, because I was too. So it has a trim right here, I guess, so it doesn't scratch you. And I mean, I think that's smart of them to think of that. And it's definitely not scratching me. A plus for that thinking. Also, sorry I have my phone with me. It's because that's what the dresses are on. All right, next dress. I can already tell you I like this one better. Do you? I can't tell if it's flattering on me or not because I don't have a mirror. I think it is. I love the color though. It is. It's, it's, it looks really good. It's also extremely soft. Like feel how soft it is. Oh yeah. And I was kind of worried when ordering it. I thought that it was going to be see-through, but it's not. I don't think it is. Let me do a full turn. You, you can see like your underwear line right there. Yeah, it's a little see. Yeah, it is. It's see-through. Yeah, I can. You can tell that there's something right there. Like there's coloring, but you'd have to be like literally this close. You are it, stepping on it a lot. <laughs> yeah, it needs to be, I'm just short, okay? And I actually have heels on trying to make it a little bit taller. Um, it has these like cool little slits in the front. I don't know if you can tell like this. So both my legs kind of peek through, so it's not your typical dress. Let me see how much it is and you can guess. Okay, I'm gonna guess this one is it's, it's weird because it's not, I feel like somebody put more time into making that one, the red one, rather than making this one. Mm -hmm. So I don't know, but it also looks better than that one. So I- I don't like my little, <laughs> shut up. my little pooch. This could either go for in the 60 range or in like the 30 to 40 range. So what's your guess? I'm gonna say 60. It is 32.99. Yeah, okay. <laughs> this is the cheapest dress that we have. But I actually like it and I love the color of it. And to add, there is no zippers, so no cheap zippers. And it also has adjustable straps mm -hmm. on top. So if you have a little bigger chest, you can let it out a little bit. If you have a smaller chest, pull it up. So I like that. Um, it's not my typical style. I don't like my hips. I think it's pretty good for $32. I'll rate that, that's number one spot. For sure. I like it better than the red one? Yeah, 100%. Yeah, and also I want to mention on that red dress, the sequins were all coming off. So, yeah. sequins everywhere. Um, I will rate this one a 4.9 out of 5. 4.9? That's pretty high. Well, the only reason why I dock it a tenth of a point is because you're stepping on these. Yeah, but that's something you get altered. So don't dock that for that. Never mind. 5 out of 5. Really? I like it, yeah. 5 out of 5 for a prom Th dress. It's $32. I was expecting a little more for a prom dress, but it is really nice, so I'm gonna give it a 4.7. I say five out of Just five. Just because it doesn't really feel like prom dressy to me. I'm gonna go put on the next dress. So, so far, this is number one, and the red one is number two. All right, this is the next one, and the zippers are in like super weird spots, but very nice. Like that was super easy to Where's zip up. Where's your zipper? Right here. Oh. <laughs> Like, I guess it's supposed to be kind of mermaid-ish. I like this, it was cute. Okay, so this dress actually comes in a bunch of different styles and colors. The other ones came in different colors as well. I actually like this. If this was in white, I would wear this to our um, couple shower. Yeah. I might reorder it if there's a white one. Yeah. I like this better than the red one. This goes in the number two spot. You don't like it better than the pink one? No. What? Yeah. That's crazy. I like it better than the pink one. Okay. Um, I'm going to guess, give me a price range on this one. 30 to 100. Okay. Well, I know it's not in 30s. I think that is... Feel it. Feels nice. If yeah. there's... Oh, it does feel really if good. If there is a white one, I'm for sure getting it. It does need to be a little bit altered, but not much at all. Like, that's about where you want it to be. Yeah. That is uh, 63.99. It is $55.99, nice. but this is what it looks like. I like this. I mean, not going off of how like it looks because everybody's taste is different, but how it feels, the length of it for your size, and like the quality, I guess. I would rate that also a 5 out of 5. Yeah, I think I like it. I think I'm going to say 5 out of 5, especially 
You can tell I like it if I'm wanting to order it in a different color yeah. for a different occasion. I went with black because I know some people wear black for homecoming or homecoming. I know people wear black for um, prom and not like the crazy color. So I wanted to get one that was just kind of like simple and I like this. I like this a lot and you can definitely like dress this up with like jewelry and stuff. Yeah. So this is dress number three. And that's a whole dollar cheaper than the red one. We are on to the last dress, so dress number four. I'm gonna go try that on now. First impressions is it smells like fish. It really does. Not very great. I'm, I'm not gonna be able to make this. You don't like, think so? Yeah, no, you're, it's gonna break. I don't wanna be in this, it smells like fish. It, it does smell like fish. Okay, you don't even have to Okay, yeah, it. that's that's not happening. Okay, so here is dress number four. Oh, one of the secrets fell off. It is not very good. No, no. <laughs> How much do you think it is? 30, no, that because that pink one was the cheapest. Oh shoot, that is $50, $60, 70, 80, 90, 92, 98. I will say this though, it has a bunch of poof to it. And that is what I was really looking it's for. It's the most promy dress. Yeah, for sure. It's just, I don't like the sequins on it. It just doesn't look expensive, which it is inexpensive. So you can't really, uh, yeah, go off of that. But this right here, I don't know if it's you can too tell. Big. It's like weird. And but I don't know if it's partly because you couldn't get it zipped I up. I think it is. So if we, here, I'm gonna. <laughs> oh, I got a size two. So you might want to size up a little bit if you have some chesticles, but... Like, I, it's not even... Here, turn around. Well, I just want to show them what it looks like if you're pulling it. Yeah, I could go even tighter. Anyway, you don't have to. Like, it's look. Okay. Look how... Oh, you can't even see. Back up. I'm just going to show. Oh, that is, like, really tight. <laughs> All right. It doesn't matter. I do really like the poofiness of it. I think that is A plus because normally when you get inexpensive dresses, it's not poofy at all. So that is good. I'm gonna give this a four out of five, hands down, like just four out of five. I just wanna say really quickly that the dress looked completely different in person than it does on camera. It does look really good on camera, but in person, not so great. I, I agree with you. It's not the worst dress in the world, but I would probably splurge a little bit more to get something a little bit nicer, or I would just go with that black dress in a different color if yeah. I wanted to be like pink. I, uh, I agree with you 100%. I will place it in the number four spot though, because that is the lowest okay. scoring for 92 bucks. I think I was, I was shocked that it was 92 bucks only because all the other ones were super cheap. But yeah. I also have to take into consideration that people will spend three to 300 to a thousand bucks on that stuff. Mm -hmm. So I guess it is, because whenever you said inexpensive, I was like, that's not the most inexpensive. But then I remembered yeah. how expensive it the other ones like are. Fish. It does smell like fish. It does smell like fish a lot. And how do you wash this? You can't really wash it. No, because then all of this stuff will come out and it'll be ruined. So that goes in the number four spot. Do you agree with my... Ranking? I would say black dress is number one though. Let me get this off and I'm coming back and doing final thoughts. My rankings are the $32 one, that's the first pink one, and then we have black, red, and then the last pink, which yes. deserves the final spot. And then my rankings was number one, black dress, number two, neon pink, number three, red dress, Number four, the last pink one that smelled like fish. With that all being said, I hope you guys enjoyed watching this video and got kind of an idea that you can get inexpensive prom dresses, but just make sure you read the reviews. And people typically post pictures of them wearing the dresses and you can kind of gauge if it's gonna be worth the money or not. Um, the dresses that I got are able to be returned, so that might be something that you look into as well. Make sure that you can return the dress if you don't like it. Hope you guys learned something from this. And like I said, just make sure you read reviews to make sure that it is worth the money and you can return them possibly if you don't like them. Sorry about the whole Corona thing going on. I hope your prom was not canceled. Maybe it is postponed. Um, I had ordered all of these dresses and we wanted to film this video and then the coronavirus thing happened. So hopefully you guys will still be able to have prom and maybe you have been putting it off and you can go out and buy these. And now you have time to get a dress. <laughs> yeah. Because if it's postponed. Hope you enjoyed this video. If you did, please don't forget to give it a like. Make sure to subscribe down below. And we hope you guys are having a great day or night whenever watching this. And we hope to see you guys in our next video. Bye, Bye guys. guys.